More protests planned for today in Ireland as part of a movement that's getting growing support online by women posting photos of underwear using the hashtag this is not consent after a defense lawyer for a 27 year old rape suspect cited a 17 year old's thong in court as proof allegedly of the teen's consent. Whatever we wear, wherever we go, yes means yes and no means no. We stand in anger and fury after yet another trial where a woman wore was used as evidence of consent. Demonstrations breaking out across Ireland backlash to a rape trial in Cork last week. According to the Irish Times, during closing remarks, the defense lawyer told jurors they should consider the underwear the teenage complainant wore on the night she alleged she was raped, saying, does the evidence outrule the possibility that she was attracted to the defendant and was open to meeting someone and being with someone? You have to look at the way she was dressed. She was wearing a thong with a lace front. Deliberations lasted 90 minutes. In a unanimous verdict, the suspect was acquitted. Outrage over the lawyer's tactic reaching Irish Parliament, where a lawmaker held up a thong. And it might seem embarrassing to show a pair of thongs here in this incongruous setting of the doll. Deputy. But the reason I'm doing it, how do you think a rape victim or a woman feels at respond. the incongruous setting of her underwear being shown in a court? He should to respond. And when is this doll going please. to take serious action Everybody on the issue of sexual the violence? He should to respond. Three minutes. The politician who says clothing as well as a fake tan and contraception have all been used as alleged proof of consent in recent rape trials, also taking part in protests. Demonstrators leaving dozens of thongs on the steps of the Irish courthouse. Online, the hashtags I believe her and this is not consent going viral. With tweets like this one saying this is a piece of clothing, a thong. It is not an invitation to invade my space. A top demand from demonstrators overhaul the way rape cases are conducted. In victim blaming in Ireland, it has no place in our courtrooms and it has no place in our streets.